Shri Satya Sai International for West Indies, Dr. Gautam Tiwari and Mrs. Tiwari, Deputy Central Coordinator, Mr. Faiz Mohammed and Mrs. Mohammed, President of Shri Satya Sai International Organization of Trinidad and Tobago, Mr. Terry Maharaj and Mrs. Maharaj, our friend, Mr. Chand Pandit Chandresh, former minister, representatives of Ministry of Community Development and Culture and Arts, Mr. Raj Kamal, my co and other colleagues in the Indian High Commission, Mrs. Day, members of Sri Satya Sai International Organization, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, Namaskar, Sai Nam, and a very warm welcome to an evening of soulful Sufi music. The High Commission of India Mahatma Gandhi Institute for Cultural Cooperation in collaboration with the Ministry of Community Development, Culture and the Arts are honored to present you a Mahfil Ashama led by Ustaz Shahid Niyazi and Party Kawali Group. <laughs>
Good day, viewers. Good day, sir. My name is Kenneth Surratt. I am the executive officer of the Trinidad and Tobago Blind Welfare Association. I think today is a wonderful day. I believe it's a wonderful day. It's an opportunity for sighted persons to come out and give service to persons who are blind, visually impaired, and low vision. I think it's an example that the rest of Trinidad and Tobago should benefit from and learn from this opportunity. Your father was a doctor and your father was backward. You see that is the reason for the cause of your action. But need that let go and you must carry on when you go turn your life around and sing a different song. Hola body chanwa Masali ke leho Rang dal ke mohanwa Nikali ke Dal ke mohanwa. It had three fellas die and went up to St. Peter. He said, when Peter said, have you ever been unfaithful to your wife? He asked for the first man said, never sir, never, never. He said, all right, you see that big SUV there, that is yours. He take that and he go on the next man. He said, have you ever been unfaithful to your wife? He said, just twice. He said, uh-huh. He said, all right, that big motorbike there, that is yours. Next man, pacing up and down, man. He pacing. St. Peter said, you, come here. Have you ever been unfaithful to your wife? He said, tired, tired, I lost come, tired. St. Peter said, you see that scooter there? That is yours. So three of them, they gone, man. When they gone down, they see the one who faithful. Pack up on this side and he crying, he crying. They say, faithful. What happened to you? You real faithful. Why are you crying? He said, oh, boy. I know see my wife pass on a scooter. <laughs> so special thanks to everyone here in whatever manner and in all manners that you have contributed. It's almost too many to individualize, but you know yourselves. And we extend our heartfelt gratitude and appreciation in all manners. And finally, we would like to say thanks to our dear Swami, such as Sai Baba for giving us the inspiration and the guidance to serve and help and be one with you all. So please bow your hearts and say thank you to the Lord and Master in whatever form you know him to be and give him just a few seconds of silent prayer. Satya Sai Baba says, if there is righteousness in the heart, there will be beauty in the character. When there is beauty in the character, there will be harmony in the home. When there is harmony in the home, there will be order in the nation. If there is order in the nation, there will be peace in the world. So our plea is let us come together with one love, one unity, one purpose of creating a better Trinidad and Tobago by each one of us contributing in our own space. Hello, good afternoon. We are here at the headquarters of the City Sai International Organization of Trinidad and Tobago and we just finished our very special program entitled EnviroFest 2018. It was a beautiful program, lovely turnout. We had a mixture of parents, children, members of the City Sai International Organization. We had invited guests in the Baha'i faith, live in waters community we had a mixture of items taking place today where we promoted going green being conscious of the environment and eco-friendly products we came about with envirofest about a year ago and we thought it was important for the Sai international organization of trinidad to promote it in this format and this style being a day of fun, a day of planting. We were out here from 7 a.m. this morning planting plants. 
We used our grounds to uh, be an example of what we should do. So we did it here on the grounds of this organization and we planted a lot of exoras, over 200 plants were planted. We did a mini kitchen garden with our school children and the parents of the children of the school, our primary school, and they enjoyed thoroughly. And once we continue to do projects like these, where people could able to enrich their lives by all these healthy styling of living. Um, the children, you know, it was nice that the schools, our Satyasai school took part. They also had a wonderful time. They really enjoyed themselves. They understand what the planting is. They get their hands dirty in the soil. And this is what all Mother Nature is looking for, right? And I must say that it will go from strength to strength. We continue these kind of programs or continue to promote the Satyasai International Organization of Trinidad and Tobago in a positive light that showing that we are really holistic in the sense of spirituality, service, healthy lifestyle, education, and all these things. And I pray that Swami continue to bless us, that we continue to go from strength to strength in these, in these programs. Thank you and Jai Sairam.
Hello Sairam, my name is Narendranath Reddy, a medical doctor practicing in Arcadia, California, United States of America. So I have been involved with such Sai International Organization for many years. Now I am the chairman of Ashanti Council, such Sai International Organization. This is the activities in more than 120 countries. Ours is a spiritual and humanitarian service organization serving the humanity for their upliftment. So I was really amazed to see the good work our people are doing in building homes for the needy and also serving food to the hungry and also providing value-based education for many people. So I am very happy to be here today to see this wonderful project which is going on and to see all these wonderful volunteers who are serving here with a lot of enthusiasm, love and compassion. I can feel the wonderful vibrations when people are working together to this, do this good work. And I'm happy to know that this is going on for more than one year. And with God's blessings, I wish it will continue forever. Because Jesus said, when you serve the least of your brethren, you are serving me. And Bhagavan Sachi Sai Baba says, when you serve man, you are serving God. This is the best way to live in love and the way to happiness. I'm thank you to be here and I'm happy to participate in the project. Jai Sai Ram. We have forgotten our bounden duty of rendering service in the community. We go on worrying of the future and brood over the past. Kanuka, Prema Sarupulara. Embodiments of love. Manam Nirantaram Kudanu, Sevara Kanti Mijina Twitteri, Tasadana Manakuta Ledu. We have to recognize there is no other spiritual practice which is more than that of sir. I'm uh, Philip Goslin. I'm a psychologist from Amherst, Massachusetts. And this is my third trip to Trinidad. And I come here in the role of uh, chairman of this zone. The Satya Sai organization uh, divides up their administrative areas around the globe into 10 different zones. And, uh, the zone I'm in charge of are the English-speaking and Dutch-speaking countries of the Western Hemisphere, mostly North America. And I'm very, very thrilled to see the activities here. I'm thrilled to see how the organization is developing and uh, that uh, Swami says, uh, expansion is our life. And this is an example of expanding, giving homes, giving food, opening our hearts to other people, opening beyond other kinds of boundaries, expansion, expansion, expansion. My life is my message, expansion is my life. My life is my message, expansion is my life.